Hey, and welcome back to my channel. I'm Wendy Pett with Visibly Fit, and we're just gonna do a quick 10 to 12 minute cardio high intensity workout. You don't need to spend a lot of time doing cardio, you really don't. And that's usually the excuse I hear is, I don't have time to work out. Well, you don't need a lot of time to get that heart rate up and for it to be really effective, and it will allow you to continue to burn calories like throughout your day. Like seriously, if you just do 10 or 12 minutes, it's really gonna have a lasting impact. You don't have to go out for 30 minutes or an hour. You don't, you really don't. So, right in the comfort of your own home, let's just do a few things. Um, we're gonna do uh, some skaters and some orchestra conductors. Uh, orchestra conductors, yes. Orchestra conductors, their lifespan are, are typically in their 90s. There's something to that. And I think it's because their hands are above their heart quite often. So we're gonna start with those actually, okay? So I've got my timer going here. And this is how it looks. Your arms are just gonna come up and out, but we're gonna go fast, okay? So it's up and out, up and out. So we're just gonna do this for 30 seconds. Of course, I should have checked my timer just now, but that's okay. We're gonna semi-time it. Good, so it's up all the way up. Make sure you're not, you know, cramping up your elbows. Make sure they're straight up and out. And it's fast, it's fast. You want to walk around, you can. Again, we're looking to get the heart rate up. If you can't stand right now and do a workout, you can do this while you're seated. Okay? So no excuses. No excuses. Good. Keep it going. Keep it going. Come on. Come on. Work it. Work it. And three, two, and one. Good. I have no idea. That was probably more like 60 seconds. But hey, we have to get that heart rate up at some point anyway. Might as well start now. So if you need to just catch your breath for just a couple seconds, that's totally fine. Uh, if not, we're going to go right into the next move, which is a punch up. So if you just go into kind of like a, a, a little squat position, I want you to put your arms up and fists like this. I will watch the timer this time. And you're just going to separate your, your arms you're going to have fists, but you're going to rotate right here at the waist. You're not going to rotate the knees and the hips, just the waist, okay? While you're going as fast as you can with the pump ups, okay? Ready, and here we go. And punch it up, punch it up. Good. The goal is 30 seconds, okay? If you want to go for a minute, go for it. In a different workout, not this one. Good, good, come on. Punch it, punch it, punch it. Punch, punch. Woo, those arms feel heavy, don't they? No, they don't, they're light as a feather. It's all in your head, all in your head. Good, and stop. Yeah, that was more like 30 seconds, good job. Feel your heart rate up? That's another one that you could do right here, okay? So if you cannot stand right now, if you're injured, if you're just not able to right now, you can do this seated. So don't let that stop you, all right? Good, if you have water nearby, make sure you drink it when you need it. The next exercise we're going to do is just a skater, okay? Now if you need to modify this move, totally fine. All you're going to do is step and cross over. Step, cross over, okay? We're gonna jump into it. Those of us that are going high intensity, okay? But if you need to modify it, totally fine. Go at your own pace, just do the best that you can, and you will improve, I promise. But we're looking to get the heart rate up, so stay low into that squat, or into that lunge the best you can, okay? And we're gonna start in five, four, three, two, and one. And go. Good. Yeah, think of those Olympic ice skaters. Think about how fast they go around those curves. Come on. Good. Come on. Ooh, the music is whistling. I can't whistle and do this at the same time. No way. Good, come on. And stop, good. 
30 seconds. Catch your breath. Grab some water if you need to. Walk around. Inhale through your nose. Out your mouth. The whistling's kind of happy, isn't it? <laughs> All right, next thing that we're going to do is we are going to do um, long jumps with four knees running backwards, okay? So if you need to modify, you'll just kind of do a big step up and then just march back, okay? If you're joining me and going high intensity, I want you to squat and jump. Shakes my camera a little bit. And then run, two, three, four. And then down and squat. One, two, three, four, okay? All right. We're gonna start in about, oh, how about, Three, two, and one. Let's go. And shake that camera. <laughs> Good. And squat. And jump. Up, two, three, four. Good. Squat. And jump. Up, two, three, four. Good. Squat. Jump. Up, two, three, four. Good. Come on. Up, two, three, four. And wow, that goes fast. Stop. Walk around. Catch your breath. I gotta catch mine. Yeah, you're not human if you don't have to catch your breath. <laughs> All right, good. Next one that we're going to do is just punch outs, okay? Those punch outs are right here. Now, sometimes my hands get a little, uh, they get kind of goofed up and they hit each other. Don't worry about it. Just do the best you can. And then we'll go into reverse mode too. Pretend like there's a punching bag that we're gonna hit. And three, two, and one. And punch as fast as you can. Arms up, not down here, but arms up. See right there? <laughs> and the reverse. I personally do better at the reverse. Good. I like to walk around. Go, 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 go. Reverse. Good. Yes, this gets your heart rate up. Reverse. Woohoo! And stop. Very nice. You can see I'm all over the place. I like to walk around. That way it doesn't seem so fixed in a spot. Next we're gonna do some jump squats. That's right, we're getting those large muscle groups going, so our hearts are really gonna to have to work hard. Now if you need to modify, all you do is come up on your toes and squat back. Make sure that your knees are in alignment with your heels, okay? Maybe you can only go right here. That's okay too. Do what you can do. But if you're doing the jump squats, Let's go full out here. And five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Jump, squat. Come on, get some air. Air under those feet. Good, come on. Keep it going. Yeah, baby. That's perfect, 30 seconds. Woohoo! Gotta get caught up on that one. Nice. We have one more that we're gonna do right here. And it's just a fast run. You know, in football, I mean, I was never in football, <laughs> but you would see the football players practice and they would be low in a, like a squat. Listen to me, low in a squat. And they would run really, really, really fast. That's what we're gonna do, okay? So, for 30 seconds, this is your last move, seriously. Ready? In three, two, and one, begin. So it's low, 
and it's run. Run, run. Fancy feet, fast feet. Run, 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 run. Come on. Run. Oh yeah, baby. Come on. Run it out, run it out. Run, run, run. Go, go, go. Come on, it's your last one, let's go. Come on. And stop. Perfect. How about that? Catch your breath. Grab some water. That was a quick 10 minute workout. See, easy peasy, right? If you do something like that, five, six days a week, man, you're gonna be golden. Doesn't have to be a big, long hour sprint or something. So make it simple, make it easy, but just make sure that you make time. Make yourself your most important appointment. Thanks for joining me and uh, hope to see you right here again soon. Have a good one.